Good evening, I'm Carly Lang. And I'm Tavares Haywood. The Capital Region is facing new storms tonight, all while still recovering from Monday's flash flooding. Yeah, that includes many businesses like Mestizo's. This latest storm marks the fourth time in just five years that that restaurant has flooded. Our Anam Siddiqui is live tonight. Anam, how are they staying open after this flooding? Hey guys, Mestizo's was open tonight for to-go orders only, even though they're still cleaning up inside like many businesses and homes in the area. This restaurant actually got three feet of water. After Monday night, Mestizo is again left without walls or floors. But to keep feeding their customers, business couldn't stop for long. The water was still kind of high for an extended period of time, so which is why we had to kind of go in and gut most of the, the sheetrock out of the restaurant. This is the fourth time Mestizos has flooded in the past five years. The area saw water again on Thursday. Acadiana Thruway had to shut down for a few hours so they could drain the water. We flooded very quickly in a very short period of time. Owner Jim Erdeles says he is not afraid the current situation will negatively impact business because people in the Baton Rouge area are used to the flooding. All the remediation, the water's coming out, the, the fans and the dryers are going to be here through the weekend. The Baton Rouge restaurant community, we, we support each other strongly. This weekend, Erdeles will allow limited capacity inside if weather allows. The, the owner plans to reopen by Monday, but they still won't have proper walls or carpet for the next few weeks. Reporting in Baton Rouge, Anam Siddiqui, NBC Local 33 News.